हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो विल बी डिस्कसिंग कैलकुलस ऑफ वेरिएशन टाइप नंबर वन प्रॉब्लम नंबर नाइन वेलकम बैक फ्रेंड्स लेट्स हैव अ लुक ऑन द गिवन प्रॉब्लम हियर वी नीड टू फाइंड द एक्सट्रीमल ऑफ दिस इज द फंक्शनल गिवन इन द प्रॉब्लम व्हिच इज वाई डैश स्क्वायर माइनस वाई स्क्वायर प्लस टू वाई साइन एक्स if you observe this functional you will find there is x y and y dash all the three variables are there in the problem therefore by euler's equation we do have two options we're going to select one because that is the simpler one do f upon do y minus d by dx do f upon do y dash equal to 0 therefore do upon do y let us put f f here is y dash square minus y square plus 2y sin x minus d by dx of this is do by do y dash of f f is again y dash square minus y square plus 2y sin x equal to 0 let's differentiate with respect to y this is zero constant minus y square is minus 2y this differentiation with respect to y here 2 sin x is constant and with respect to y derivative is 1 minus d by dx of with respect to y dash this is 2y dash this is zero and with respect to y dash this is also zero because the entire term is constant which is equal to zero therefore minus 2y plus 2 sin x minus 2 this 2 is a constant will come out d by dx of inside we do have y dash and what is y dash dy by dx equal to zero if you multiply inside this is minus 2y plus 2 sin x minus 2 this term will become double derivative that is d square y upon dx square equal to 0 minus 2 d square y upon dx square let's take that side therefore that will become plus remaining term i am keeping on the same side only Minus two d square y upon dx square will go that side and will become plus. Let's take two common on RHS. This is minus y plus sine x. This will be cancelled, and you will be left with a d square y upon dx square is equal to minus y plus sine x. Friends, the same story. Again, we are left with the same term. here we do have x and y both therefore and this is higher order equation therefore its solution will be cf plus pi if it would be only sin x let's say this is the only term and minus y is not there then in that case we need to double integrate because on left hand side it is d square y upon dx square double integrate sin x first integration will be minus cos x then minus sin x but here we do have x and y both therefore its solution will be cf plus pi for that purpose let me repeat the process minus y will come this side and will become plus y equal to sin x as discussed this particular term will become capital d square y why is this plus y equal to sin x let's take y common this is the equation for finding cf we want auxiliary equation for writing down the auxiliary equation as discussed we don't consider this y as well as sin x we are left with the d square plus 1 and this is the same that we got in the last problem d square is minus 1 plus minus root of minus 1 plus minus i these are the roots of d therefore cf will be it is a complex root it will be e raised to 0x 
c1 cos x c2 sin x e raised to 0 x we know is 1 c1 cos x plus c2 sin x is the required solution that is cf but we know solution is not exactly only cf it is cf plus pi we need to find it out pi also and the formula is 1 upon fd into rhs fd means this whatever in auxiliary equation here it is d square plus 1 into rhs rhs friends is this that is sin x by looking at this you can conclude this is type 3 this is type 3 of pi in type 3 we replace d square with minus 1 d square with minus a square minus fixed and a here friends a is 1 sin ax sin x a is 1 minus 1 square is minus 1 but the problem is if you replace d square with minus 1 you will get 1 upon 0 which is not a valid solution therefore I am not going to do this because I am not getting the valid solution what I need to do is I am going to multiply with x and I am going to take the derivative d square plus 1 derivative d square derivative is 2d plus 1 derivative is 0 and here we do have sin x this is the same example we have discussed in solution of higher order differential equation d is a derivative and 1 upon d is a integration basically this is x by 2 this 1 upon d is actually integration integration of sin x is minus cos x we got the pi minus x by 2 cos x and what is the solution friends cf plus pi what is the cf c1 cos x plus c2 sin x this is what we got it and pi is minus x by 2 into cos x this is the required solution y is equal to f of x we got the solution hope you understood we're done with the problem thank you